All right, welcome to the Ravid Show. We are here at YOLO Vision 2024. Uh, super excited to be here with Pavel, who works for Hugging Face. Uh, Pavel, welcome to the Ravid Show. Yeah, thank you, thank you. I'm really excited to be here on this uh, awesome conference, actually. Yeah, yeah my name is Pavel, uh, and I'm working at Hugging Face uh, more as a computer vision engineer. That's nice. Uh, yeah, yeah, I joined uh, Hugging Face around uh, half a year ago. Nice. Uh, yeah. Previously, I was uh, also working with the uh, open source and the uh, computer vision. Uh, I have actually my own uh, project on the GitHub that right. has uh, a lot of uh, downloads also. And uh, uh, if you probably like uh, someone from the community work with the image segmentation in nice. computer vision, nice. they probably like know my uh, uh, libraries uh, on the GitHub because Very it has cool. like about. 10,000 stars already. Wow, yeah. Yeah. that's Very awesome. Nice. Yeah, uh, yeah. Great work that you're doing in the space. Thanks for sharing that. Uh, Pavel, I'm also kind of interested to know about, uh, uh, first of all, I know you have a talk. What is it about? And uh, I also want to know how would it help the community? Yeah, today I'm going to, to talk about like how you can use Hugging Face open source tools uh, for your own uh, project. It might be a right. computer vision project. Yeah. It might be like, not computer vision project, there are like different tools. Yeah, and how you can benefit from them actually, how to make your project more accessible for community, right. how you can share your results. Yeah. I, I love it. And uh, I'm kind of also wanting to know a little about what do you think about YOLO? You've been, you know, obviously we've been here, but then I'm pretty sure as a computer vision engineer, you kind of keep a tap on everything and YOLO is one on your mind as well. So kind of curious to know, what do you think about YOLO? Uh, they also launched YOLO 11 today. Yeah, yeah. So exciting it's stuff, exciting but news. happy to hear your thoughts. What do you think? Uh, yeah, first of all, it's exciting to see like another iteration of the YOLO. It's uh, cool that uh, it's not like uh, saturating. The guys keep pushing this uh, forward, like yes. better metrics, better performance. It's actually nice. And what I think also that uh, in Hagen phase, we are trying to make the uh, AI actually like uh, computer vision uh, and ML more accessible for, for the human, for community. And uh, this is actually what I think YOLO also do. So they, they make like uh, things simple to, to everyone and accessible. Yeah. That's awesome. Uh, thanks for sharing that. Also, as a computer vision engineer, I'm curious to know uh, about how do you see the future because i'm pretty sure you've seen all the growth in the space uh, but it's always evolving yeah so yeah. wanting to know a little about the future what do you think about it uh, and um, how is it going to help the larger community to grow as well yeah i see right now that uh, like if you're talking about like more technical stuff here so there are a lot of uh, efforts for like uh, multi-models uh, where people trying to to cross like LLMs and computer vision and many efforts like two days ago there was a release of a multimodal llama for example right yeah right yeah that's cool uh, and I think that this is a kind of future that we will have like huge models but uh, what also curious of so, like we will still I guess have like a particular kind of small model that could be run on edge devices and. Or maybe we'll see like a, a new generation of edge devices that could handle these huge models. Yeah, uh, that's awesome. Thanks for sharing that. Uh, looks like the future is good. Uh, yeah. So definitely looking forward to it. And um, one last question for you, uh, Pavel. If folks want to reach out to you, learn more about your libraries. Uh, obviously, there's a huge community who already knows you. But for those who don't know you, uh, where can they reach out to you? Where can they learn ab more about the stuff that you're doing? Is LinkedIn a best place? Is X a best place? Maybe your GitHub repository? Yeah, I have a LinkedIn, of course. I have a GitHub, so I have email, like any any source of this you can use and reach me. Yeah. That's awesome. Thanks for uh, you know visiting the Robert Show. Thanks for chatting with us. Uh, such a pleasure chatting with you. And uh, definitely look, looking forward to keeping the conversation going and uh, keep following you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Thank Ranesh. you very much. Such yeah. a pleasure. Thanks, everyone, for joining us today.